kind of windy where I am, so bear with me. Sorry about the sound. But I'm in a very, very remote section of Death Valley called Saline Valley. And the reason they call it Saline Valley is they used to mine a lot of salt out of it. Um, you can kind of see right behind me, there's a huge salt lake. It almost looks like the Bonneville Salt Flats, like white crystalline salt. Well, back in the day, they used to mine the salt out of this lake and then transport it on a sort of, um, like a, not a conveyor belt, but there's these, tra like a tram kind of. These little wooden pylons, I don't know if you can see these wooden stanchions along the way. Back in the day, they used to go all the way up over those mountains into the Owens Valley. The 395 is on the other side there. So they would uh, mine all the salt out of this lake bed and then put it in the buckets and take it all the way up and over this mountain into the other side. It's pretty crazy that these wooden pylons are still standing. Those were the supports for the cables. But obviously the, you know, the buckets and the cables are long gone now, but you can still see all these wooden towers going up over the mountain and you can still walk right down to the edge of the Salt Lake. It's really a trippy experience. I mean, look at how surreal this is. <laughs> Wow, I mean, look at this. This looks like it was some kind of a pier back in the day. You can see these little nubby stubs down here in the, like they're just crusted over with salt and mud. But I think those were, back in the day, that was probably the pillars that supported those, that tramway. Because if you look around behind us, you can see the tramway going all the way up over the mountain there. There was another one coming that way too. This, I mean, the Salt Lake is huge. Look at it. That's some pretty good, solid white crystalline salt. Reminds me a lot of the Bonneville Salt Flat. Look at that. Wow. It's really neat. It's such a surreal place. My sister's way down there at the end, trying to collect some salt so we can do another one of our famous coconut oil salt scrubs. Because we've just spent a week out here hanging out of this hot spring that you can camp at and our skin is, you know, the minerals in the hot spring water are great, but it leaves your skin feeling a little dried out. So we definitely need a salt scrub with a little coconut oil mixed in. I mean, shit, look at this salt. Holy cow, look at this, wow. It's pretty cool, I'm gonna have to do some nudies here. I mean, yeah, it's good quality salt. Let's see how it tastes. Mmm, salty. It'd be great on a margarita. I mean, holy cow, look at this salt. Lake, this is absolutely astonishing. It's like a field of snow. And it just goes on and on as far as the eye can see. Looks like the tramway at one time went this way as well. I want to go this way because it goes out to where there's actually still standing water. Whoa, gotta be careful walking on this salt. The top is real crusty. But it doesn't support much weight. I mean, I only weigh like 100 pounds and I'm sinking through. Wow, this is so amazing. I have rarely been at a place this surreal. Whoa, <laughs> foot fell through the surface. Wow, man, you really have to be careful not to fall through the layer of salt crust because if you do, your foot will break through and this is what will happen. Blah. Gross. Salt is kind of hard to walk on, I'm not going to lie, just because it's hard on top, but it's not quite solid, so your foot sinks in a little bit with every step, but it's totally worth doing because it's so interesting, it's so fabulously surreal out here, it'd be a great place to shoot like an album cover, I mean look how beautiful and reflective this water is, oh I got a cut on my foot and I can feel the salt water stinging it. Beautiful. Wow, 
I mean, my feet are completely filthy now from stepping into that muck. I don't know if you can see that. Um, but I'm glad we stopped. It was a really neat thing to check out. And hopefully I got some good photos out of it. Shot a few nudies there, too. <laughs>